absolutely. And something else fascinating tonight. We've got Josh in for Natasha and that you're watching the fascinating skies tonight with a tea, a thunderstorm. Uh, yeah, thunderstorms cropping up across parts of western Oregon and Washington. And that's going to be the case for the next hour or so before we start to lose some of that daytime heating. But some very ominous looking clouds out towards places like McMinnville. A time lapse view of a developing shelf cloud. That's where cold air kicks out of a thunderstorm and helps the development of lower elevation clouds and eventually putting down a few of those light rain showers. And I was actually able to manage to pick up on a lightning strike with our camera out that direction. This was at about 525 this evening. You can see the thin bolt there off in the distance when thunder roars head indoors as our skies are still holding on to that cloud coverage out towards McMinnville with temperatures falling back into the mid 40s. But the culprit for all of this wild weather is a persistent low pressure system just offshore, helping the flow of moisture find its way back into our region as we've managed to pick up on a few of those lightning strikes over the past several hours in western Washington County. And we're seeing daytime highs into the upper 40s. So a little bit of a taste of spring, but that also comes with a chance of snow. We'll be discussing that in my extended forecast in just a few minutes. All right, yeah, our attention with snow, Josh. Yeah. Thank you.